Now, as we all know, the Hyderabad is the first city in the country which is known as Digital India City. And I must appreciate uh, Pramod and his whole team that the first international digital conference is held in same Hyderabad. So, my sincere thanks to Pramod and whole team that uh, they will give a lot of knowledge to our youngsters about the uh, digitalization in the dentistry. Now, when we are students in late 70s, mid 70s, and now we have experience of nearly 34, 35 years in the teaching. The scenario in the dentistry and in all together in the medicine and all has changed. Now, as Pramod has rightly said that earlier, the diagnosis was by whether it is a medicine or in dentistry, by simply by asking the question to the patient. And that, that diagnosis, diagnosis may not be fully 100% correct. But now, with this digitalization, this diagnosis has reached up to much, much higher level. If the diagnosis is proper, then automatically our treatment protocol will change and we can save the tooth much, much better way. In that, recently, the CADCAM systems, CBCT, smile designing, even the digital set guiding has come. He quote very nicely that uh, swachha mu, swachha sast. That means if our oral hygiene is swach, then our sast will be also very swach. Now, he has given a very nice example. We are preventive. Any cancer you detect, we can detect in the oral cavity much earlier. But in general medicine, they are not preventive. When the cancer is already there in the lungs or anywhere, they have to go for surgery or any other method. We can prevent cancer if it is properly monitored up to the rural health center. For that reason, Dental Council has also given a responsibility to all the colleges in the country, they have to have a satellite center, minimum one or two, so that we can serve the rural people. Seventy percent of the rural people is still untouched, unaware about the oral hygiene. We have to get entry in this rural area. And this is only possible if my 309 dental college students will give a proper duty in the rural area and we can educate them how the oral hygiene has to be maintained. We can cure a lot of diseases, not only in the oral cavity, throughout the body. I personally believe that everybody, sometimes I see in the WhatsApp and all that, there is no job in dentistry, there is no job in dentistry. This is not practically true. Dentistry is a skill-based professionals. If anybody has come for a job in dentistry, probably he has not chosen a proper line. How many jobs a government will give? Up to what level? 26,000 students per year admission in dentistry in the country. So many MDS are there. So it is a skill based. The problem in the dentist is that everybody wants to settle in the major city. You little go inside and see your practice. How many chartered account is getting their job facilities? How many lawyer getting the job? How many engineers in the country Lacks of engineers passing through, how many are getting the job? The job is not the priority. Up to certain level, any state government can give a job. We have requested each and every state government in the country that up to the primary health center, there should be a dental surgeon minimum. So I will not take much more of time. With these few words, I again thank Pamod Gandhara and his whole team 
for organizing such a beautiful conference in Hyderabad, which is known as earlier known as the Digital City. I hope all the success of this conference. Thank you very much.